We start at Woodlands, where last season's silver medalists filed face Sheffield Tigers. This contest ebbed and flowed in Lancashire, with both sides holding healthy leads, but in the end, the points were shared. There was no shortage of drama in our next three games, starting at Lockwood Park, as Kobe Opoku Forfi's late try for Hull Ionians proved to be enough to hold off a battling Huddersfield. Next, we head to Lynn, but it was heartbreak for the newly promoted side, as Lewis Verity's late converted try in the Northwest snatched the win for Wharfdale in this seesaw battle. Off to Watley now, where recently relegated Hull were the visitors, and they left their host crestfallen as a late penalty try swung it for Mike Amanga's charges, who secured their first win in over a year. Less tense but equally as entertaining at Clifton Lane, as Rover and Titans hit the ground running with a thumping victory over New Boys Billingham, with Lloyd Haynes collecting 22 points. After relegation from National 1, Leeds Tights began a new era with a hard fought victory over a spirited Sheffield. The lead changed hands on multiple occasions, but it was back to the winners' lounge for Pete Seaborn's men. And finally, we head to the North East, where Preston Grasshoppers responded to going 12 0 down to eventually keep Tyndale at bay as Alex Key's side got off to a successful start. Some tightly contested games are running theme across National 2 North, with five teams, including the aforementioned Preston, all picking up maximums on the opening day.